and you look in the sky and oh god there's a weather there's a there's a, a Chinese, Chinese lantern that's so that's so amazing you watch it and it's like and you have like slow music playing if this was like a romantic yeah. comedy and stuff and then mine is like dun 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 dun, dun. <laughs> there's a kid in a weather balloon dun 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 dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Hey, what is up, guys? Uh, I, I, I want to welcome you back to a brand new episode of HS Craft HS Survival. Craft. So we did some, um, we did some work, me and you. We did some cool stuff, and I'm quite happy. And uh, yeah, we were gonna have a chill day today, but we decided to do a tiny bit of recording for you guys. So, um, what do you want to show off first? Do you want to show up the show off the Hobbit hole, or do you want to show off your hole? Oh, okay. Oh. 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 Jeez. Watch, the, watch getting a cookie all over the place. I have oh, God. so many. How many did you make? A lot. Okay. Well, at least I got food. Okay, so what do you want to show off first? You want to show this off since we're here? Okay, so this is our little hobbit hole. We're going to use this for all of our food storage. Um, we got all these farms and stuff around here. We need somewhere to put them all eventually, so we're going to use this little hobbit hole. i got to put some windows in still. The vines haven't fully grown in, so um, this isn't what it's going to fully look like, but I guess this is good for now, a good start. And then inside, I'm still in the process of making this too, but there's going to be two big rooms, one here, one here. This is going to be for all meat products and stuff like that. This is going to be for all the other stuff. I'm thinking about putting some packed ice on the floor and on the walls to make it look like freezers. That'd be kind of cool. Um, so yeah, this is our little hobbit hole. We're going to use that. So uh, I'm, I'm pretty happy with this. I like the little designs and decorations and stuff. Eventually, I want to take leaves and... Um, vines and I want to put them all over all of our wooden buildings so those two and that one over there maybe the fishing shack and then maybe a tiny bit over here just make things look a little nice um we originally had these I was using these trees for just getting acacia wood but Brie grew them up and they ended up looking pretty nice she liked them so we decided to um keep them, keep them there so yeah eventually we'll go through and do what kind of what Brie's been doing what I've been doing making some like fake trees some real trees um putting down bone meal, that type of stuff, just really purifying this place. So do you Perfect. want to go and look at uh, at your my, hole? My hole? Yeah, it sounds a bit weird. Oh, she planted some cocoa beans there from our journey to the jungles in the last episode or a few episodes ago. I can't remember which one it was. Yeah, it was last episode. So, oh. oh, God, there's a lot of mobs already spawned down This is there. quite impressive. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not that much. This is 10 by 10 down. Uh, uh like 60 blocks so that's pretty dang good she got us a ton of smooth stone so i'm super happy yeah. about that i'll probably okay. cover it up and just add i don't know maybe we can make a little mob spawner <laughs> uh what you just oh, why not go through the hole uh, shut up. Uh, <laughs> i'm gonna plug it behind us okay all right let's go and um look at what we have to do oh i'm getting a tiny bit laggy let me try to turn my trees to smart I'd get laggy whenever I go by um by the chicken cooker. Okay. So I've made the uh rabbit hole. Or the not the rabbit hole, the uh hobbit hole. And uh I think I know what I'm gonna put here because uh we're gonna do this this episode. Barkery Barsment. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, yeah, do you want to work on the Barkery Bossman with me today? Yeah, we should work on it. Wait, but before I do that, I need to go to the um, the, the horses and put... Because I got more hay. Oh, nice. Okay. Mm. Let's see how our chicken is doing. Nice. We got 34 in there. We need to probably put a little bit more chickens in there to get us up to where we can get, like, a stack an hour or something. So we've been on for about two hours now, and uh, we've only made about a half a stack, so we need to keep putting more in there. So yeah, there's still these little wool blocks around from um, where Bree's going to put her trees after, so that's pretty cool. I need to cut down these trees because we actually need some of this in our build today. Um, yeah.
Dasa. Oh, watch it, watch him, watch him, watch, watch him, watch him, watch him. Hold on, I'll go get a lead. I'll go get a lead. All right, oh, the most sorry. important thing about moving Cal is having enough leads Wait, he's to going, pull him he's in. Going, he's going. Oh, okay, come on, come on. Come back. okay. Just keep up. Oh, you almost trampled. You almost trampled. You almost trampled crops. Watch out, watch out. Hold oh, no. on, I'll go. He's, hold on, I'll be back. Now. He's, he lost interest. I was holding a cookie, and he looked at that, and he thought it might be better than the wheat. He wasn't quite sure, and so he got interested in it. I'll be back. I'm going to get a leads. Alright guys, we are back, almost ready to go. Um, we, oh, this is really weird, I found a sugar cane underground. Or not underground, but underwater. It's like, just planted. Um, so I'm grabbing some more clay. Bree is going to head into the nether in a little bit to get us some more quartz for the corners. And we are almost done with the basement bakery, or the uh, barkery barsmith, so... Whatever you want to call it, we're going to pronounce it probably the barkery barsmith. Um... And, yeah, then we'll be ready to start, like, putting everything together and making everything look pretty, I guess. It's almost purtified. Um, we'll just make it look perfect, I guess. And then... You're perfect, I you're guess. You're perfect, I guess. Yeah. But don't they look like paper Chinese things? They do, like little lanterns, right? Well, I have a right? story. You do? Do you want to tell us? Look. Oh, I thought you were going to be like, no. I said... Oh. That would have been funny. Oh, one time... <laughs> Yeah. I think, I believe it was, uh, when was it? Yeah, it was my brother's birthday, I believe. Mm hmm And we were going home from this Chinese restaurant that we were, wait, no, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm f trying to figure out when it, <gasps> no, wait. Oh. Wait. I I fuck, I forget what event it was. It's okay. Let me think. Mm hmm I know I was with my mom, I was with my dad. Your brother was probably there. I don't know if my brother was there. Oh, <laughs> well, it probably Actually, wasn't his was. birthday then. <laughs> but it yeah. wasn't with Hannah. So I think it was like someone's birthday. Or we went somewhere all together. Yeah. It wasn't his birthday, though. Okay. Um, but we were going home. It was dark. And right. I looked. But my mom was like, whoa, what's that in the sky? And I looked down in the sky. And I was like this little, like, candle lit Chinese thing. I was like, whoa, that's so cool. I've never seen one of those before. Hmm. It's so pretty. I want to do that one. Yeah, so that those are pretty dance. cool. That's pretty awesome. Um, <laughs> I remember one time where I live here in Colorado, some people uh, released a, a weather balloon and said that their kid was in there. Oh. Um, and the news was covering and everybody was freaking out. There were people out there like following it, racing down the highway as it went to see if it was going to land and try to keep up with it and stuff like that. And uh, all this stuff, you know, hours and hours and hours, everybody was watching the news because this, like, six-year-old kid was in a weather balloon, like, thousands of feet above the ground, right? Mm -hmm. Weather balloon finally lands. They come up to it. They open it up. No kid. Oh. So they're like, oh, God, the kid fell out some way along the highway or whatever. So they start this huge manhunt and everything, and they're, like, searching and searching. 
And eventually the family's like, we found the kid. We found the kid. He was in a box in the attic. We thought he was in there. And um, they're doing an interview with the kid. And they're like, so what happened? Where were you? And they're like, I was in the box where dad told me to hide. And so like, they're like, wait, what? And they're like, yeah, he told me to go in a box up in the attic. So they found out that this guy and his wife told their kid to go hide in a box in the attic and reported that he was in a weather balloon to get national, like, notoriety and everything and have everybody freaking out. And and um, they were hoping to get a reality TV show from it. What the f- Yeah, they did. They're, like, serving prison now. Um, Do you have the oh. chests and the things? The chests? Oh, yeah. And then the hoppers? <laughs> Let's go down here. Yours is like driving at night and you look in the sky and oh god there's a weather there's a there's a, a Chinese, Chinese lantern that's so that's so amazing you watch it and it's like and you have like slow music playing if this was like a romantic yeah. comedy and stuff and then mine is like dun 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 <laughs> there's a kid in a weather balloon dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Jesus Christ finding a place for our uh ah we'll worry about the rest of the clay later <laughs> um and we'll probably do it though for now. Let's come up here and I'm gonna come back like right back here. Get a good look around everything. You wanna stand in the middle on where like you go and we'll get a, a thumbnail. Yeah, like right there. Like that. Perfecto. Okay. Um let's go cut down that sign and maybe see what we need to do. In case I don't have the pig pen on there, maybe I'll put the pig pen on there. Or the cow cooker. We need to do a, do both of those soon. Yeah. Cow cooker to get us some leather for frames later. Zombie villager just hanging out in there. I can see his little feeties. Okay, let's see. I already have field for pigs. I guess, uh, cow cooker. Did you do anything? Uh, oh, you can finish the enchantments too. No, I need the rods. Do you? Okay. Uh, I don't know what to add. We gotta go exploring again. Where should we explore later? Oh, we'll explore for a place to put the um, factories. Somewhere close by, but not too close. Explore more. Right on. Nice. Um, I think that's a good place to wrap up for today. We did a good amount of work. Uh, that's probably going to go ahead and do it, though. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have been Hippie, and I will see you guys next time. Alright guys, so if you want to see the last episode of this series, go ahead and click that big box up in the top left. If you want to check out who was the last subscriber of the week, click the top right. And for some random video, you can click the bottom right.